This has been way overdue, but we had to wait for the weather. This roof needs repairing. I don't want any leaking. Hey guys, so we had to wait for the weather to be better for us so we could uh, get this roof fixed. Um, I've had some leaks. We don't want any more leaks. All right guys, so we're gonna use this liquid rubber. Um, first, we gotta go through with the seaming tape and I gotta seam up any kind of seams on every part that has a crack, any seam. Get it all seamed up with the rubber, kind of like paint it on and put it on. Um, that's step one. This is how cold it is. Like, it's still not warm enough to do this right, but we can't wait any longer. It's an ice ball. Alright, so we covered all the seams. We only have uh, some minimal. Let's see if you can see this one. A little bit of a minimal, some of my pants too. Um, seams are covered. It's getting late now. Everything's still frozen. My primer's probably gonna be frozen too. So I'm gonna wait and I got the primer and everything inside the RV, which I should have done in the first place, keep it room temperature. So tomorrow morning I'll come out, prime it all, and then I gotta wait about 24 hours, and then I can add rubber, more rubber coats, and just cover the thing as many coats as I can do. Um, it's looking kinda gloomy out, but it's not calling for rain. I hope it doesn't, because I need this stuff to cure. All right, so uh, everything dried great. Um, I actually didn't do some outer seams, like on this side, I saved a couple because I wanted to make sure I got everything else done and it got late last night. So I did those real quick this morning, they're still a little tacky, um, but everything else dried really great. So now I'm going to put the primer on. I got a roller, but I couldn't find, i too close, sorry, I couldn't find um, an extension, so duct tape on a metal pole. I think we can get this job done. Cause I'm gonna have to uh, be from the outside, just kind of rolling in. Um, I'm gonna put the primer down. Um, that makes it a lot stickier and a lot more adhesive for the rest of the rubber to go on. And it is really windy, uh, so unfortunately I'm not gonna be able to film myself doing it. Tripod would just fall right over. Um, I can show you it after. Well, I opened the primer. And it was filmy, and as you can see, something happened to it. I don't know. I kept it outside. I didn't think it mattered how cool it got. Um, apparently it does. Either that or when I put it inside to warm, I had it kind of close to the heat. I don't know. Something messed it up, and the primer's not going to work. So now, I just... I, I'm asking Beth what she wants to do. I don't think we can wait to get more primer in here. Um, I already got a seam started, so I think we're just gonna apply the rubber and go. Um, and hope that it sticks right. We'll see. I mean, it's gonna be better than what it was, right? First coat is on. And it's not tacky. So I got two more gallons. I've used two gallons. So hopefully two more will do it. Um, that'll give me three coats. And I 
hope that's that I hope that'll keep the rain out. I think it'll do better than what it did. It wasn't as it wasn't too bad as is, so this has gotta be better. I hope. I got coat number two done. Um, weather's great today, a little bit windy, not too bad. Tomorrow's supposed to be super windy, so I'm trying to get a third coat done today. Let's see what happens. Alright guys, we got the, the third coat on. Um, I am completely just covered, it's all, it's all over me. Uh, so, like I said, the primer was messed up, I didn't get the primer. This stuff is super sticky, it seems to be working. Um, it's already dried the third coat late in the day. Um, dries really quick, it takes about 24 to 48 hours to cure. So now we just gotta wait and see if uh, this is gonna not leak on me. I'm not gonna wait for it to rain to show you. Just have to keep watching. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you on the next one.